Hey, what's up, YouTubers? I'm just doing this uh, video to show a trade I just got from one of my favorite signal providers. It's a buy trade. It's a one-hour trade. It's for the euro yen, and it's also on Cantor. I got filled at I think 48. So I like to get filled at 50 or 57, but sometimes the market moves so fast up or down, you can get filled for slightly out of the money. Now it's in profit about six or 90 cents. I bought about 15 contracts. So if it expires in the money at the end of the hour, um, I'll let you know, and it'll be $15. I paid a little under eight bucks for it. So um, just want to make a point to um, a couple days ago, or I think it was last week, there was absolutely zero liquidity after 1 p.m. Eastern time. That's the one problem with uh, with Canter Exchange. Sometimes there's absolutely no liquidity on anything. Uh, but <clears throat> excuse me for like five and ten minute strikes and for one hour strikes. And now, recently with uh, the 4 p.m. close Eastern time, these are all Eastern time strikes. You can get plenty of liquidity, usually like a thousand to three thousand, sometimes five or ten thousand, depending on what you're trading. Um, for small traders who want to put on a, a thousand bucks on a counter exchange, you can just trade half or one percent of your account. That's what I like about it. And you can get a slow rising equity curve. That's one of the benefits of a counter exchange. I just want to put this video out there um, just to let people know what you can do with it and what you can't. Uh, I don't like to trade on counter buy trade. I mean, close a, a trade out early because the platform, at least for me, sometimes isn't always letting me close out. The strikes like right now I could with a 75 cent profit I could just hit the close button but um, I usually don't like doing that especially on five minute binaries and I also believe you get an edge if you only go long on five minute binaries and um, you hold till close because too many things can happen even on Nadex on a five minute binary sometimes something weird happens and you can't close the thing out and you take a loss and if you would have let it settle it would have settled in the money because of the way the uh, cash settlement works for five minute bin binaries it gives you a slight edge that's why I don't really short five minute binaries. Anyhow, I'll shut this off and wait till the end of the hour and let you know how this uh, turns out. All right, I'm back. Um, as you can tell from the chart, about half past the hour right in here, it got right down to like a little bit out of the money. I bought 132.60 and it's 132.59 here. And then it shot right back up. So my point is you have to really make sure you know what your probabilities are when you buy a strike on counter exchange and then from here at the end it just has taken off right now you can see from the profit and loss I have about a 585 profit the markets at 85 cents it's it's pretty far in the money right now and I paid 46 cents I bought 15 contracts which comes out to about six dollars ninety cents so I'll, I get about seven dollars my main point right now is not so much I want to point out uh, one of the main benefits of Canter, at least in my opinion. You can buy a really small amounts of contracts. So like if you have $1,000, you can buy 1%, which would be $10, which if you bought at the money would be uh, 20 contracts. Cost you $10 to get 20 at the money. Um, I bought this a little bit out of the money. So f for an $800 account, it, it uh, cost me six dollars ninety cents what, what I'm getting at it's only one percent of your capital and if you don't trade that much or if you just want to trade half a percent you can you can really manage that risk so as long as you have a high win rate over time your equity curve will go up to me that's one of the main benefits of trading on counter and now that it has a lot of liquidity for these small amounts um, usually you can get the liquidity around eight or nine eastern time and from what I can tell, when there's liquidity on there, it lasts all the way to 4 o'clock. And my main thing is I trade the hour strikes. A lot of people trade the 5-minute uh, binaries. And for those of you who like 5-minute binaries, I, I like Cantor a little bit better because uh, you can just trade the euro dollar 5 minutes all day long, and there's 5- and 10-minute strikes like just all the time. The only difference really is they have a 5-pip uh a difference whereas on uh, Nadex it's four pips uh, so you have to decide that, like if you want to buy in the money or, or, or at the money I only do at the money stuff I don't really do it in the money but um sometimes not too much anyways we're let's see about two minutes before this thing closes out and just just so you know like when you're on your your counter exchange trade a logic platform 
you can just close it out right there by hitting the click but the green button hit close I don't want to do that I just want to let it settle as you can see the markets come down from like 88 cents to 76 cents so um, this is not going to be a close one I'll probably it's, it's got about a minute left I'll win this you know pretty far in the money so I bought 132.60 it's at 132.68 about four and on counter just like on Natix you just have to win by a fraction of a pip and if it's against you by a fraction of a pip you can just lose it that easy but my experience those kind of trades even out over time anyways um, like share subscribe leave it a, a comment if you want I'll just wait a few more moments to let this thing clear out so I don't have it on here but my margin 690 I'm just watching it real closely and right when uh, this thing you know clears out they adjust your account balances right away so you can trade your gains if you want to and this is just a like I said another one of my favorite signal providers um, the only downside of counters they don't have that many uh, instruments you can trade I think seven including gold alright It's now done. Let's see if it readjusts. Yep, it readjusted my balance, so I got my original money back, and um, they adjusted my balance up to what it was. Anyways, thank you.